Welcome Scorpio to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of April 1st to the 15th of 2024. As I was getting into the Scorpio energy, uh, as many of you know, I read my environment. Um, I accidentally dropped uh, my cards into my cup of coffee. <laughs> so Scorpio, you may have things that are occurring during this period of times that may seem harder than they need to be, but you need to continue to take action because you're gonna fall in love with a new lover. This could be a new level of loving. This could be a art project, something that you really deeply fall in love with and have a great passion. May I say the words dance, dance, dance. Uh, for, um, you know, many of you have your own music that gets your vibration up. If you do it in the privacy of your own home or you're out there with others, you do need to dance. It really does raise your vibration. I do feel a new passion coming through, a new passion. So if this is becoming healthy, if this is developing a healthier relationship, I see a healthy coming uh, a new passion coming. And for some of you, you may get news about your health or um, something that you need to take care of. And I do feel this is going to be your new passion. You're going to change your energy around. And, and here we go. Here's the king of hearts. I was going to say, let's get into love, romance, and relationship. And here are the king of hearts. This is a commitment this is, if you're already in a committed relationship, this is you're making a commitment to, I, I keep on going on with the whole health issue. So whether this is physically, mentally, emotionally, or spiritually, <clears throat> I see that you may be at a crossroads. And you know what I just flashed on? Um, uh, you know, like a machine, like a money machine, keep giving money. Uh, so I don't know what that's about. So I feel like you're, whether you're, uh, it, finances increase because of this relationship. Let's just go on. Here's the middle of the deck. It's the open safe. I get it. I am in love, romance, and relationship. And here we have the safe coming out. It's all about the money. You're going to be okay. Crossroads. Love, romance, relationship. Should we try to continue with that? Love, romance, relationships. I'm going to wait for a couple cards to pop out. Whew. Scorpio, April 1st to the 15th of 2024. Please, Spirit, show us more. Oh, here's the action sign. Here's the action and joy. This is what I was intuiting before. There's something about your passion. You're gonna become completely passionate about something, Scorpio, and it's gonna bring you a great deal of joy. So we're talking about this love, romance, and relationship. So this is either gonna bring you into something else, or this is literally, uh, maybe you're picking up a new pastime and you're just loving it. You're gonna have a lot of good luck with this. So <clears throat> honestly, I saw the good luck and, and then the phenomenal luck. I don't know what you have brewing. So you, Scorpio, if you have a plan or you see something that's gonna manifest, please put it in the link below because whatever it is, is gonna be a major blessing. Um, Scorpio. Now look, the conflict cut card came out. So you, this I feel are many of the Scorpio, <clears throat> you cause your own conflict because of self doubt. You get out of that. What you think about, you bring about. Here's the money. Yes, we're talking about love, romance, relationship, and you're getting out of debt. You're being successful. Some of you are gonna be able to make that move, build that house, uh, pay that rent, go to a new place. Um, what's, you know, I feel like there was a brokenness about the Scorpio, whether it was a, a relationship or a job or a major upset that had upset your life. I feel that you're getting a new passion back again. Let's go on to career finance Scorpio. 
And here we go. Finance Scorpio, looking good. You're gonna have friends there. Oh, this is wonderful. Oh, and now here's Cupid. <laughs> Look, we're talking about love and romance right now. I mean, career and finance. And now comes Cupid. So look, this is definitely an intertwining of the energies. Um, the passion, the, the friends, the money's there. The safe is there. So, but you remember, you also got the mountain card. So you need to make sure you play friendly. This is in career and finance, and you will be successful. Um, as I do my private readings, I like to do uh, the positive and the negative of a person so um, they know what they need to work on. So this is the strength of the Scorpio during this particular time. Oh God, thank God. It's almost over, the time's almost here. When I see that, you your current challenges will still be resolved. You'll be able to look at the future with a smile. Uh, if this is your strength, oh my God. So that's right there in your corner. Oh, thank you, because I know you Scorpio. I think that many of you have just been through it. Now this is your shadow side and what you need to bring light to and work on your manifestation needs. So many of you do know how to manifest, Scorpio. Practice, practice, practice. Have fun with it. See? This is your shadow side. Work on that. Um, you know, I, I got this deck of cards from a friend from New Zealand. His wife was of the Mori tribe, and I want to say thank you. And for some of you that really has taken your time to show me the right pronunciation or even get into more deeper meaning of the card itself. So I will read from the book, Scorpio, April 1st to the 15th of 2024. Spirit, show us more. Moco, tattoo, number 21. Take a look at that card right there. And you see that, look at the eyes. Really intense here. Success, honor, triumph, holistic well-being, positive forces. Oh, thank you, thank you. Look, MoCo, and I read that straight from this book. And it is, honor, triumph, holistic well-being, positive forces. Look, if this resonated with you and you would like a private reading, patrellasintuitiveinsights.com listed in the link below. For those of you, um, it really helps my channel. It's fast and it's free and it really does help me. Leave a kind comment, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, with that, thank you and God bless you, Scorpio.